Let's talk about a kitchen staple, mayonnaise. It's that unassuming jar tucked away in your fridge, always ready to lend a helping hand to your favorite dishes. Whether you're a die-hard fan or a casual user, mayo is a silent hero in kitchens around the world. It's the creamy soul of potato salad, the secret weapon in a turkey sandwich, and the unsung star of countless recipes. With just a spoonful, it can turn a dry meal into something luscious and satisfying. More than just a sauce, it's a binder, a flavor enhancer, the glue in countless dishes. It brings together ingredients that would otherwise never mingle, creating harmony in every bite. From BLTs to aioli, mayo transforms meals from bland to unforgettable. It's the difference between ordinary and extraordinary, elevating even the simplest sandwich to new heights. But have you ever wondered how this simple mix of oil, egg, and acid becomes the smooth, shelf-stable jar in your fridge? It's a process that's both surprisingly simple and incredibly complex. The journey from raw ingredients to perfect emulsion is a blend of culinary art and industrial science. It's a delicate dance where timing, temperature, and technique all play a crucial role. Making a batch at home is one thing, producing millions of identical jars is another. The scale and precision required are truly mind-boggling. The magic of mayo lies in its simplicity, oil, egg, and acid, transformed by emulsification. This process creates that signature creamy texture we all know and love. This process, scaled up, is a feat of food science. Teams of experts work tirelessly to ensure every jar is as perfect as the last, maintaining consistency and quality. Imagine a symphony of machines, all working in harmony to create that creamy texture. Each step is carefully monitored, from mixing to filling, to guarantee the perfect product. So, let's pull back the curtain on one of the world's most famous mayo brands. Hellman's has become a household name, but few know what goes on behind the scenes. We're going on a virtual tour of the Hellman's factory. We'll see the people, the machines, and the passion that go into every jar. We'll follow the ingredients from farm to jar, tracing their journey from the fields and farms to the bustling factory floor where they're transformed into the mayo you know and love. We'll explore the science that keeps it together, from the microscopic structure of the emulsion to the rigorous testing that ensures every batch is safe and delicious. And we'll see the lengths the company goes to for safety and taste. Every jar is checked, every ingredient scrutinized, to make sure only the best reaches your table. Prepare to have your appreciation for this everyday condiment elevated. There's a world of effort and expertise behind every creamy spoonful. You'll never look at a jar of mayo the same way again. The next time you reach for it, you'll know the story behind the creaminess. This is the story of mayonnaise. Let's dive in and discover what makes this humble condiment truly extraordinary. Our story begins in 1905, not in a sprawling factory or a corporate boardroom, but in the heart of New York City, inside a humble deli nestled among the busy streets and old storefronts. This was a time when the city was alive with the dreams of immigrants, each bringing their own traditions and flavors to America's melting pot. Richard Hellman, a determined German immigrant, opened his delicatessen on Columbus Avenue. He brought with him not just a passion for food, but a desire to share a taste of home with his new neighbors. In the back of the shop, Richard's wife whipped up her own homemade mayonnaise, a creamy, flavorful spread that quickly became the secret ingredient in their popular salads and sandwiches, Customers couldn't get enough of the rich, homemade taste. Word spread fast. Soon, people weren't just coming for the sandwiches. They were asking to buy the mayonnaise by itself, eager to bring that special flavor home to their own kitchens. Sensing an opportunity, Richard began selling the mayonnaise in small wooden containers, offering two different versions to suit his customers' tastes. It was a simple idea, but it caught on quickly. To help customers identify the very best batch, Richard tied a blue ribbon around one of the jars. This blue ribbon wasn't just decoration, it was a promise of quality, a mark of his personal guarantee. The blue ribbon recipe soon became the talk of the neighborhood. People would ask for it by name and the jars with the blue ribbon flew off the shelves. As demand soared, Richard made a bold decision. By 1913 he closed his beloved deli to focus entirely on producing mayonnaise, turning his side business into his life's work. He built a small factory, designed the now iconic clear glass jar, and officially launched Hellman's Blue Ribbon Mayonnaise. The clear jar was a new idea, letting customers see the creamy product inside and know exactly what they were getting. From the very beginning, Hellman's stood for quality ingredients, fresh eggs, pure oil, and tangy vinegar, blended to create that unmistakable homemade taste. The transparent jar built trust with customers, 
showing off the rich, creamy mayonnaise and setting Hellman's apart from other brands that hid their product behind opaque packaging. This commitment to transparency and quality quickly made Hellman's a household name, and customers everywhere began to recognize the blue ribbon as a symbol of excellence. What started as a single deli's secret recipe soon spread across the country. Hellman's mayonnaise was shipped far and wide, becoming a staple in kitchens from coast to coast. The blue ribbon became more than just a label, it became a symbol of tradition, quality, and the American dream. Today, that same commitment to quality continues, but now on a massive scale, with modern factories producing millions of jars each year. The journey from a wooden butterboat in a small deli to millions of jars on supermarket shelves is a true American success story, one built on hard work, innovation, and a simple blue ribbon. It all began with a great recipe, a clever idea, and a blue ribbon that stood for something special. That's the remarkable origin of Hellman's, a brand that's still loved by millions today. Now let's take a look at how Hellman's mayonnaise is made today, carrying on a legacy that started over a century ago. Great mayonnaise starts with great ingredients, oil, eggs, and vinegar. These simple staples are the foundation of every jar, and their quality makes all the difference between an ordinary spread and a truly exceptional one. For Hellman's, sourcing is a masterclass in quality control. Every step is carefully monitored, from the moment ingredients arrive to the final product leaving the factory. The main ingredient is soybean oil, sourced from a network of trusted farmers. These partnerships are built on years of collaboration, ensuring a steady supply of high-quality oil that meets strict standards. Every batch is tested for purity, color, and flavor. Anything less than perfect is rejected. This rigorous process guarantees that only the finest oil is used, contributing to the smooth texture and rich taste of the final product. Eggs are the heart of mayo, and Hellman's uses only 100% cage-free eggs. This commitment not only supports animal welfare but also ensures a fresher, more flavorful ingredient. These arrive as liquid yolk, pasteurized and tested before entering production. Each batch is checked for consistency, color, and safety, so only the best yolks make it into the mix. The yolk's quality is crucial for that signature creamy texture. It's this attention to detail that gives Hellman's its unmistakable richness and smoothness. The acid comes from a specific distilled vinegar, checked for exact acidity and taste. This vinegar is chosen for its clean, sharp flavor, which balances the richness of the oil and eggs. Salt and a secret blend of spices round out the flavor. These carefully measured additions are what give Hellman's its unique, crave-worthy taste. Every ingredient, no matter how small, is scrutinized before joining the mix. Nothing is left to chance, each component must meet the highest standards. This meticulous sourcing ensures consistency and safety in every jar. It's a process built on trust, science, and a relentless pursuit of perfection. Only the best make it into Hellman's. Every jar is a testament to the care and expertise behind the scenes. Next, let's see how these ingredients become mayo. The transformation is both an art and a science, blending tradition with modern technology. The journey continues in the factory, where precision and innovation come together to create the perfect spread. Quality starts long before the jar. Now, the science begins, ensuring every batch lives up to the Hellman's name. With oil, egg yolks, and vinegar ready, it's time for the magic emulsification. Oil and water don't mix but egg yolk contains lecithin, a natural emulsifier. Lecithin acts as a bridge, binding oil and vinegar into a stable emulsion. In the factory this happens in colossal machines called colloid mills. Egg yolks, vinegar and spices are pre-mixed, then pumped into the mill. A precise stream of oil is added as a rotor spins at high speed, breaking oil into microscopic droplets. Lecithin surrounds each droplet, preventing separation. The result, a thick, stable, perfectly smooth mayo. The smaller the droplets, the creamier the texture. This high-speed microscopic dance is the secret to Hellman's signature consistency. It's food science in action, scaled up for millions of jars. Emulsification is the heart of mayonnaise. Next we make it safe to eat. The process is just getting started. Let's talk safety. After emulsification, safety is the next priority. Even though eggs are pasteurized before arrival, Hellman's pasteurizes the finished mayo too. Pasteurization means heating the mayo to a precise temperature. Hot enough to kill bacteria, but not so hot it ruins the emulsion. 
The mayo flows through a heat exchanger, quickly reaching the required temperature. It's held just long enough for safety, then rapidly cooled to preserve texture and flavor. Computers and sensors monitor every step. This heat and cool process is crucial for both safety and quality. The result, a delicious safe product in every jar. Pasteurization is non-negotiable. Now it's time to fill the jars. The journey continues. Let's see how mayo gets packaged. The creamy mayo is ready for its final home, the iconic glass jar. Empty jars, cleaned and inspected, travel down a conveyor belt to the filling station. A high-speed machine dispenses the perfect amount of mayo into each jar, bottom up to prevent air bubbles. Hundreds of jars are filled every minute, each to the exact same level. Lids are placed and twisted on, creating an airtight seal. The pop you hear at home means freshness. Next, jars are labeled with the classic blue ribbon and all the important info. The entire process from filling to labeling takes just minutes. Automation ensures speed, consistency, and safety. From vat to jar, it's a marvel of efficiency. Now let's talk quality control. Every jar must pass the test. Before leaving the factory, every jar faces rigorous quality control. Automated systems scan for contaminants, fill levels, lid tightness, and label accuracy. Any jar that fails is instantly rejected. But machines aren't the only judges. Human experts sample jars for color, aroma, texture, and taste. The classic Hellman's flavor must be perfect. If a sample fails, the whole batch is investigated. Only jars that pass every test are cleared for shipping. Quality is non-negotiable. Now it's time for distribution. The journey isn't over yet. Let's see how mayo gets to your store. On to the final leg. With quality checks complete, it's time to ship millions of jars nationwide. Jars are packed into cases, stacked on pallets by robots, and wrapped for transport. Barcodes track every pallet's journey from factory to store. Pallets are stored in climate-controlled warehouses, ready for orders. When a retailer orders, forklifts load pallets onto refrigerated trucks. Keeping mayo cool preserves its quality. Trucks deliver to distribution centers and stores across the country. Within days, the mayo is on supermarket shelves, ready for your sandwich. It's a logistical feat. Now a few fun facts before we wrap up. Did you know Hellman's is called Best Foods West of the Rockies? Same recipe, different name. Mayo isn't just for sandwiches. It makes cakes moist, crisps grilled cheese, and works as a marinade. Hellman's Chicago factory produces millions of pounds of mayo every week. The scale is staggering, constant ingredient flow, non-stop machines, endless trucks. Next time you open a jar and hear that pop, remember the science, history, and care inside. It's a humble condiment with an epic story. From farm to factory to your fridge, it's a journey of chemistry and dedication. That's the story of Hellman's mayonnaise. Thanks for joining the tour. Now, who's hungry for a sandwich?